Hello, welcome back, viewer, to Let's Play Legacy of the Wizard with Blackfire Devil. This time, let's do Lil's Quest. Now, I want to get the spike boots and the almighty matak. I think it's still called the matak. Now, for Lil's Dungeon, like how with how with Zems, we use his power gloves, and her part of the dungeon, we will be using her ability to jump really freaking high. I will, I have, dang it, I have also decided to not get the dragon shield yet even though I should and that's basically what I'm going to get right now is a bag of money to buy an item that bag of money that I skipped all the way in the beginning of the game this will also let me collect a few keys. Oh yeah, I forgot. I, I can jump kill. <laughs> wow. Tall blonde moment there for me, people. Just wait. Let me count. One, two, three. Huh, I wonder. I might actually be able to get it if I can get a just a bit more gold without wasting that chest. Okay, I'm gonna go see if I can. You can say this is kind of like a fetch quest. I don't really think of it as such. It's just the first part of Lil's crown quest. You just really want to make sure you have the right items for the job. Damn it. I always pick up the poison for some reason. Guess the poison might just be attracted to me. My poison magnet. Everything I touch dies. Yeah, that's a good thing, actually. Well, not everything I touch. I don't have the magic armor. I might pick up the magic armor later, though. The magic armor basically is a upgrade of the spike boots. Instead of having to jump on stuff to kill it, Basically, everything you touch will die. Like, um, kill you. Sweet. Oh, yeah, I don't have the mud talk, but there. Now, let's go in here. Okay. Now, I gotta go back up. So yes, I, you could say I'm kind of doing another fetch quest, but I'm not going to be totally fetching here. I'm also going to do her crown quest as well. You know, viewer, I'm going to cut this part out of the video. I'll be back when I get to the point I want to. See you then, viewer. Hello, viewer. Welcome back. I have got the money, and I'm now going to get the dragon shield. Now, let's get out of here. 
Also, something I did off screen and for the hell of it, I learned. Ah, crap. Uh, I learned that you can totally do Maya's Quest, or Maya, whatever her name is. Why am I missing that? Oh, well, you can do Maya's Quest with Lil if you have the spring boots and 99 keys. Don't ask me why someone would want to do Maya's Quest with Flail. Maybe it would be different. I mean, I'm doing this different. However, getting 99 keys is basically a two hour grind. I might do like an extra video after I'm done with this, or I might actually do Maya's Crown with Flail. It's actually like a wee bit easier with Flo because she can high jump. And here we are, the start of Lil's area. Let's get this going. But yes, it is possible to do crowns without the respective person that you need for it. It is just a lot harder. Now, let's see if I remember the shortcut. Should be around here somewhere. No, I don't remember where it is. Damn it. It's been a while since I've done Will's quest. Or is it right here? Nope. Well, this sucks, viewer. I become lost already when I just started Lil's quest. Well, this sucks, viewer. Welcome to Let's Play. I'm lost. Have fun, viewer. <laughs> Has to be around here somewhere. Okay, let's go back. I know there's a secret passage somewhere. And I'm about dead again. You know what? I'm gonna stay at that end. I want help. Keep the same items. Wow, this is horrible. I did not get this lost in the practice video. It went up here. Oh, this also doesn't look right. And I know this takes me back. Oh, wait, this is.
Okay, viewer, I'm so sorry about this. Next time on Let's Play Legacy of the Wizard, I become less lost. <laughs>